Still raw. Wait a minute. This says L E R. What does that mean? Hey guys, retired at 40. There's nothing more frustrating than a Traeger grill conking out in the middle of the process of making something. And mine is doing the LER. It's basically a safety precaution. If your grill does not reach 125 degrees within 10 consecutive minutes, it will shut off automatically. This LER code is really common if you're doing a low and slow smoke. It will happen more often if you run out of pellets, if you're in a cold climate, or if it's a windy day out. So let's see if we can get this fixed. The first thing you want to check is your fire pot. If, the, if you have too many pellets in your fire pot, or your grill is not clean, it's going, to, uh, it's going to make some funky stuff happen with your temperature control. I know mine is good because I just cleaned my grill before I started this and it uh, did an error. So step one is check your fire pot and make sure it's clean and not overloaded with pellets. The second thing that can be wrong is your heat, your sensor or your grill can just be too cold. So if it's a cold day out, you just need to heat up your grill. You can do that with a space heater or something like that, or you can just uh, try it in the garage maybe. Uh, as you can see, this is not the case. It's a beautiful Colorado day here, and it is not too cold for my grill, I can guarantee you. All right, the last thing you can do is adjust your P setting. And the P setting basically just tells the auger when to put more pellets into the fire pot. Um, if you're running too hot or too cold or having trouble maintaining temperature, you can adjust this P setting. The newer models do not have a manual adjusted P setting. The older ones, there's going to be a thing right here, right next, right to the right of the LED, and you can. It's usually a sticker. You can pull the sticker off, and you can use a paper clip or a, a screwdriver or something. And you just want to push that in. When you push that in, you're going to have a P1, a two, or a three. And basically the higher P setting, the cooler it's going to run. Uh, the lower P setting, the hotter it's going to run. So hopefully one of these three options helped you get it working. To reset it, all you need to do, just turn the grill off. And turn it back on, that will automatically reset everything. And go to smoke, just like you were starting it up when you were first starting a cycle. So my problem ended up being that there was just too much uh, dust, sawdust, in the bag that I bought. So it looks like this bag has probably been sitting for a while and it may have gotten wet. More than likely it's a fire pot or a temperature issue with your grill. Alright, there we go. I'm back in business. Hopefully you found this video helpful. Take a moment to subscribe with my other Traeger videos. This is Retired at 40. Remember to live life simple. We'll catch you next time.